My name's Davey Rothbart, and uh, I make this magazine called Found, and a couple books we've had here called Found. And now for the brand new book, Requiem for a Paper Bag, what I've done is ask some of my all-time favorite artists, writers, musicians to share stories about stuff they've found. And it's all just notes and letters that people find on the ground, find on the street, you know, a love letter, to-do list, uh, photograph. People find this stuff, send it to me from all around the country, and we put it together into these books called Found. Every single person has some great story about something they found, whether it's a bottle they found washed up on shore with a note in it, or some post-it notes they found blowing down the street. And I just wondered, yeah, like, what would happen if I asked my favorite, you know, it was sort of an excuse to get in touch with my favorite artists and musicians and writers and just ask them, you know, what have you found? And the responses I got were pretty amazing. But for me, my favorite is still the one that kind of sparked the idea, the idea of doing Found Magazine in the first place. And it was this note that I found in, on the windshield of my car in Chicago. There's just something funny about how she's so angry and upset, but still like hopeful and in love, you know, pays me later. I think what I like most about these found notes is just the universal aspect of them. It's like when I'm laughing at some found love note, it's because I have written the same love note a hundred times before. And you know, you can relate to them. And they also spark your imagination because it's just a piece of the story. And it's up to you to piece together the rest of it and fill in the blanks.